today we're in Jakarta, Java, Indonesia. Jakarta is actually our last stop in Indonesia before we fly off to our next destination. We've heard mixed things about Jakarta. You wouldn't expect this to be in Jakarta. It's a chaotic, busy capital city. A lot of people find it a bit too much, a bit overwhelming and don't really explore the city and just use it as a hub to come in and out of Indonesia. We're here to find out whether it is actually worth exploring. So we're leaving in two days. So we have two whole days here in Jakarta. Let's go see what there is to do here. <laughs> It's known for how chaotic the traffic is here. Yeah. Probably going to take a while to get anywhere today. So we've just got here to Kota Tua, which is Jakarta's old town. We're starting here at Fatahila Square. Uh, the buildings, if you look around me, they are from the Dutch era. This old town has many Dutch colonial buildings from when Indonesia was actually ruled by the Dutch. So we're just taking a walk around the square now. It's very different to the rest of Jakarta. You wouldn't expect this to be in Jakarta. Um, it's quite, quite a nice place. It's quiet, it's, it's quite quiet. peaceful. So online it says that this square is actually very busy, but the first thing I notice is it's not busy, it's very quiet. Mm. It yeah. is half one in the afternoon though, so maybe it gets late, busier in the evenings, who knows, but I can yeah. tell you what, it's quiet. Yeah, there's a lot of people dressed up um, where you can pay them to like have a photo and stuff like that. There's like some bicycles you can rent, which are all different colours, like it's quite a picturesque kind of place. <laughs> photo they've actually got recycling bins here Good. that's amazing <laughs> big thumbs up punch and judy punch and judy where you've got the original <laughs> yeah. the original or the original no way you no. get the <laughs> Yeah, the British Embassy who give us this really? for collection. You can see the upstairs the collection. Wow, okay. Let's have a look. So we're still in Kota Tua, the old town, and we have come across a puppet museum. So there's a guy outside and he said that they've got the original Punch and Judy that the British Embassy gave them. So let's go see if that's I'm right. fact checking. Thank you. Okay. So it was 5,000 rupee each to get into this museum, which is quite affordable. This is what I look like when I wake up at 6am. Go and do a hike. <laughs> go and do a hike? <laughs> it's what you look like when you wake up at 3am to go and do a hike. <laughs> I really don't want to do it. But that's what I look like at the end. found Punch and Judy from England. Probably not the originals, but Punch and Judy are here. Here they are. It's actually giving me nightmares. It's horrific. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh, it doesn't look as scary up close. No, that looks so much worse a minute ago. If you have a fear of like dolls or anything like that, don't come because it is quite freaky. Good egg. I am. The jackfruit. Jackfruit. What is jackfruit? Is it nice? So we've come to this little street food market in Kota Tua and we ordered some Indonesian food. So we have ordered Nasi Good Egg Ayam. And then I ordered Nasi Soto Ayam, which is soup with chicken. So I ordered a 
mocktail called Blue Ocean. Um, it's got blue sugar. The ingredients in cocktails blue, something in them with a C. But it's got that in it, but obviously no other. Um, I'm not really sure what else it's got in it. Tadpoles. It's nice. It looks like tadpoles. It was 10,000. 50B, about 60 centimetres. It's like a mix of Oreo and like a sweet, sweet kind of uh, taste. It's kind of strange, but it's nice. nice. It's nice. So I was right, it's like an Oreo milkshake, but it's got like bits of jelly in it. I don't know what I order most of the time, I just go for it. <laughs> Thank you. I think that's mine. Is that yours? Yeah, I don't know what that is. This is your curry here, right? I don't know who's this here. This, I think, is going to be spicy and I don't like spice, so let's just see how we go on strut. <laughs> It's got chilies in it and it's quite spicy, but it's quite tasty. Just try a popular food now. I don't know what that is, tofu maybe? Nice. I think it's like potato, like a soft potato. It's quite spicy, but it's quite nice. So, yeah. Well, let's try this What's one. That? I think that's what I had the other night. What is it? I don't know. The liver thing. Tastes like liver. Is it like liver? Yeah. It looks like liver, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's okay. It's not my go-to of meals because obviously I'm Western and we like a lot of different foods than Indonesian food, but it is quite tasty and always worth trying something new, right? Yeah. What do you rate it? Out um, of 10. The whole meal as mm. a whole, I'll give it probably, probably 7. 6.57. Seven. Right, let's try my soup. It's nice. What did you say it was? Like coconut soup? Is it spicy? No. No. It's similar to Thai green curry. Oh, okay. But Thai green curry is spicy. It's a bit without the spice. Oh, nice. It's just like a coconut soup, basically. So, yeah, it's quite nice. It's like a curry soup. Yeah. It was um, only 20,000 rupiah. Just remembered that this is jackfruit. <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> you I like, like it? Mm. I like yours. She's what? I want to keep mine. <laughs> <laughs> So, Soph, can we get your markings out of 10 for your meal, please? I give it a 7 out of 10. Thank you. Yeah. Excuse me. Sorry, how could you ask? What was this? That's the jackfruit I told you. That's jackfruit? Yeah. Oh, what was in the, in the orange one? That's jackfruit. Jackfruit. And then I just like this. And also the chicken. The oh, Lovely. Thank you very much. So, I was completely wrong with what I thought I was eating. This is jackfruit. That was tofu and potato. And then rice, obviously chicken. Um, I'm not really a fan of the jackfruit. If the else was all right. Um, so yeah, I still stick with my 6.5 out of 10. There were a lot of museums there, 
and that seemed to be the main thing to do. So if you like museums, then head there. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna head somewhere else now and see what else Jakarta may have to offer. Just left Chinatown. Um, it was very busy, but it was also very cool. Um, there was loads of really exotic animals. You saw turtles and tortoises, um, hamsters, loads of hamsters. <laughs> uh, like some good food and stuff like that. There was a lot of people. It was very busy. There's a lot of people around, yeah. so we couldn't really work out um, where it is or what. Yeah, what to do there. I think we were in yeah. it. There was a lot of Chinese shops. Everything was Chinese. I bought some paracetamol. It was Chinese. You bought some scissors, which is Chinese. So we, we did buy a China st town stuff, but I think it's just massive. Like you could just keep walking for yeah, ages. It's like. huge, um, and it's all very spread out. Hello. And yeah, there's lots of. Um, is that a snake? Is it? Oh. Okay. Donut. Donut. Okay. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I thought it was a snake. It's donuts in a box. Thank you. Um, <laughs> Yeah, there's lots of like street food and stuff, it all looks really good, totally yummy. But we have just eaten so we can actually eat any with bowls yeah. from the food earlier. Uh, yeah, overall it was alright, something to do. If you are in need of bits and bobs, go to Chinatown because there's loads of bits and bobs you can buy. Yeah, some performers there, we gave some money to some street performers and stuff like that. Um, you do get a lot of people begging, so just be careful. No, it was good, I think it was alright. Yeah. Something to do in Jakarta.
<laughs> launching pigeons. It's our second day in Jakarta, so we thought we'd head to the National Monument just to see what it's all about. Um, it looks cool online. We came here yesterday, but I think we were too late because it was closed. Hello. How are you? Yeah. Back last one us. Closed. Closed. So we came back today to check it out. So today um, we checked out of our hotel and Tyler went to have a haircut. Fresh trim. What are you doing? Getting fresh trim. Mustang the barber in Jakarta. Fresh trim for our next destination. We fly today. Fresh trim. <laughs> and we've been trying to sort out our accommodation for our next place, which we messed up a little bit. Um, you'll see in the next video. Yeah, uh, <laughs> and yeah, and we thought we'd head here before we head to the airport. Just the last little thing it's to add to our Jakarta itinerary. More photos. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to do that. We did do it last night. Like, it's got left hanging. <laughs> I've lost count of how many people have asked for a photo in Indonesia. So five minutes of fame. It makes you feel like you're famous. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the national monument here in Indonesia. It is a national monument for the Republic of Indonesia. It is built to commemorate the struggle of the Indonesian people. It was the 3 p.m. that's close. So this gentleman here was saying it's a three hour wait to go to the top. And you got to walk up there apparently. Because no, today is weekend. Today's the weekend. It's busy. Yeah, so it's busy yeah. Oh, okay. Well, All right. We've got three hours, have we? No, we've got to get on the plane soon. All right, thank you. All right, thank you very much. We've just finished our two days exploring Jakarta. Going off what we've read online, as we said earlier, busy, chaotic city. People mainly just use it to fly in and out of. People don't really tend to explore it. In our opinion, if you are flying here, if you're in Jakarta, you're flying in and you're flying out and you've got some time to spare, then it is definitely worth exploring Jakarta. Yeah, even and if you've got a day to kill or a day Free. Definitely worth it. The monument today was unreal. So cool. Yeah, it's it, it was really nice. Nice setting. It was like in a little park. There was uh, locals around having picnics. There was the market there. Street food. And um, then we've got the Chinatown. Jakarta Old Town we went to yesterday, which was really nice. I really enjoyed that. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there are things to do here. You've just got to leave your hotel room and have a little explore. Don't just wait for that flight. And don't yeah. just write off Jakarta and think there's nothing to do here because there is still quite a lot to do. So tonight we are flying to... The Rock. <laughs> Singapore. So we're going to be exploring Singapore from tomorrow. We're staying there for three nights. And we, we are backpackers, we are on a budget. So if you want to know how to do Singapore on a budget and if it is even possible, then make sure you subscribe to us to watch our next video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We are going to be trying out all kinds of street food today in Jakarta, Indonesia. It's so good, it's so good. We're really excited.